Ahoy there, landlubbers and sea enthusiasts. Brace yourselves for a splash of excitement, because the legends of the deep just got a whole lot toothier. In a jaw-dropping twist that's straight out of a blockbuster, marine biologists have confirmed sightings of the infamous Megalodon. That's right, the giant prehistoric shark we all thought was extinct is making waves once again. Did you know that Megalodons are so enormous that a satellite can easily detect them if they are swimming on the surface of the water. Take a look at this incredible image captured by a satellite. Well, during the initial investigation, the agent who was studying the swarm uh, noticed something out in the water. Okay, kind of a speck. Yeah, well, it, yeah, at this resolution, it's a speck. When they zoomed in, though, they got this. This massive creature in the photo could very well be a megalodon. If true, this might be the evidence we need to prove that these legendary sharks are still alive and not extinct. It's a breathtaking glimpse into the mysteries of the deep. If you look at this other satellite photo I brought, it was taken at the same resolution of a school bus yard in nearby Sao Paulo. Now, those are 40-foot buses, and when you compare them next to the first photo, I'd say that's a 70-foot shark. Watch out this video, a megalodon attacking a fishing boat off the coast of Cape Town, South Africa. At first, everything seems peaceful and calm on the water. The fishermen are going about their business, enjoying the serene ocean. But as darkness falls, something creepy happens. Out of nowhere, a huge monster attacks their ship, causing chaos and panic. People are screaming and running around, terrified of the giant creature they've just seen. Most of the survivors told news channels that they saw a megalodon the legendary giant shark thought to be extinct. It's a chilling encounter you won't want to miss. In an astonishing turn of events, a video has surfaced showing what many believe to be a baby megalodon. The footage reveals a huge creature swimming gracefully through the ocean, but its body looks different from any known shark or whale. The unique shape and massive size of the creature have left experts and enthusiasts alike in awe. Could this be the long-lost offspring of the legendary Megalodon? If so, it's a fascinating glimpse into a species we thought had vanished from our seas. This incredible video could be the evidence we need to confirm that Megalodons are not just ancient history, but still roam our oceans today. In 2010, a kid in Chile shocked the world with an amazing discovery. The government and researchers had placed cameras on the seabed to study marine life, many of which are also available for live streaming to the public. This kid was watching the stream from camera number 847 in the Pacific Ocean when he saw a shadow swim past. Although not much was visible, a huge fin caught his attention. The researchers noticed too so they zoomed in and calculated the size of this mysterious creature. After examining all the visible body parts shown in the footage, they concluded that the creature had to be over 62 feet long. What else could it be but a megalodon, right? This story dates back to 1869, when an Irish scientist embarked on an expedition to the Seychelles. He originally set out to study fish, but he encountered something far beyond his expectations. During his research, he discovered two remarkable specimens. The first was over 15 meters long, nearly 50 feet, which was already astounding. However, the second specimen truly took the spotlight. It was alleged to be a staggering 23 meters long, or about 75 feet. Since this discovery happened so long ago, there wasn't any official documentation. But if there had been, the second specimen would have held the record for being the largest ever recorded. It's absolutely wild to think about. 
Seeing such a creature would be one thing, but imagine being able to actually study it. Check out this incredible video of a huge creature, possibly a megalodon, examining a ship. <laughs> my uh, goodness. Where's my phone? <laughs> megalodons are known for their aggressive behavior, and if they sense something wrong, they can destroy everything in their path. While it's not confirmed if this massive creature is a whale or a megalodon, the footage is certainly captivating. Keep watching to see if we can uncover the truth about this mysterious giant of the deep. Nice positioning. On a sub, Captain. <laughs> this is fantastic. Wow, look at the size. I mean this video has been making waves on the internet as possible proof that megalodon sharks are still out there and can even venture near the surface of the ocean. The footage shows what looks like a massive, 19.5-foot-long shark circling around three divers, protected only by a metal cage. The shark appears to be trying to grab hold of them, but it doesn't succeed. While this sighting is unsettling, many people remain skeptical about the existence of megalodons. The main reason for doubt is that if this shark were a megalodon, it would have to be a young one, as adult megalodons are believed to be at least twice this size. Despite this, the video still presents a terrifying situation. Being in the same waters as such a giant predator would be nerve-wracking, don't you think? While many agree that the Mariana Trench is a frightening place, some people still doubt that anything truly terrifying lurks down there. However, the truth is, there's plenty to be afraid of, including this massive shark spotted at the bottom of the trench. The giant creature appears to be minding its own business, enjoying its solitude before potentially hunting a whale for sport. Experts believe this footage is likely authentic and hasn't been edited. Adding to the realism, it seems the shark may have ventured too far up from the depths causing its flesh to decay due to the changing pressure. It's a chilling reminder of the dangers lurking in the deep. Imagine if a megalodon were coming straight for you at the beach. What would you do? Let us know in the comments below. Scientific Evidences of Megalodons Research into megalodon nurseries has uncovered fascinating details about these giant sharks. Scientists have identified five potential nursery sites across the Atlantic, Caribbean, and Pacific basins. Fossils from these areas, ranging from 16 million to 3 million years old, suggest that these nurseries were crucial for young megalodons. According to the study, our analysis supports the presence of five potential nurseries ranging from the Middle Miocene to the Pleistocene, with higher densities of individuals estimated to be within the typical size range of neonates and young juveniles. It goes on to reveal, these results show for the first time that nursery areas were commonly used by megalodons over large temporal and spatial scales, reducing early mortality and playing a key role in maintaining viable adult populations. This indicates that these nurseries were vital for feeding and protecting younger megalodons, much like how modern sharks use similar areas. However, there's a pressing question about why megalodons became extinct. While there are many theories, no one knows for certain. The same scientists studying megalodon nurseries also suggest that the loss of these crucial areas might have contributed to their downfall. They explain, ultimately, 
the presumed reliance of megalodons on suitable nursery grounds might have been a factor in the demise of this iconic top predator. As the planet changed and climates shifted, these essential nurseries may have disappeared, impacting the survival of young megalodons. While it's a compelling argument, the exact cause of the megalodon's extinction remains uncertain. Holy crap! Oh my god! It's coming right at the ROS camera. Sharks, as a group, have survived five global extinction events, but the megalodon's fate is still a subject of intense study and debate. It's bouncing Laser off of his him. body. Yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> And there you have it, folks. Who knew the ocean's scariest shark could be making a comeback like it's auditioning for the next big monster movie? If this video made you want to keep a closer eye on the water, don't forget to hit that like button, share with your fellow sea-fearing friends, and subscribe to Underwater Scaries for more spine-tingling tales from the deep. Keep swimming and stay spooky.